You're watching the book reviewer with Cindy Brady, where we make hardcovers soft. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of the book reviewer with your host Cindy. And I have another book review to share you guys. So, um, this review was best suited for yesterday. Um, yesterday was July 4th in the United States, which is our Independence Day. Um, so that's a little bit of a precursor to today's book review, which goes along historically with yesterday. And I'm sorry, you guys, I wanted to do a video. I had planned to do a video, but things just didn't happen the way I wanted it to. So I'm doing it today. So, um, this is a historical fiction book. Um, this is based on American history. Um, so this is the book today. It's called My America, Five Smooth Stones, Hope's Diary. And this takes place in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania in 1776. Now those of you who have taken or remember American history will know that July 4th, 1776 was a special day for everybody that had come from England that were displeased with the king's rules and wanted religious freedom. So they had settled into colonies and things like that to establish their new world that they had found and they set it up like they had things at home, stores, communities, things like that. And so the king still wanted control over these people who had not totally broken away from England. So just to give you a little bit of background. So um, this girl, Hope, um, she lives during the time period when the Declaration of Independence is written. Um, and so this is a diary, as I've said, um, of this nine or ten year old girl um, that is living in this time period. Here is what this is about. Thursday, the 18th of January, we are waiting for Papa. But we know not if he is hurt or captured, or, oh, to think he may have been killed. We speak not of our fear, for we began to cry. He went to sea the day after Christmas. He, I cannot write on this page why, because tis a secret. We are at war with England, and King George is now our enemy. That is all I may say. As tensions rise between the Tories and Patriots in 1776, Hope's life begins more and more confusing. She wonders if she will ever see Papa again. Her brother Ethan has proclaimed that he is a Tory and have left home. Will Hope's family ever be reunited, or will the Revolutionary War keep them apart forever? So, this is a good book. It has 122 pages, I believe. No, 100. Well, 100. And three pages. Um, what is great about these books, um, it, it does not have a Kindle edition, you guys. All I could find on Amazon was a place to order the hardcover, like I have here, and a paperback. But, um, so this diary um, goes over this time period, and I thought it was Pretty, a pretty perfect video for yesterday, but like I said, things got busy and I didn't have time to record and upload a video for you guys. But this is a good book. Um, I would recommend it to um, especially kids like 8 to 12 or anyone who's interested in history. This would be considered a historical fiction book. So what they do is they pick a time period, like this one is in 1776 
and they pick a character and they write journal entries as if they are in that time period. So it's a pretty cool thing. My mother and I like them. Um, I will put links down um, on Amazon where you can order the book or you can get it through your local library. You can find it that way too. So um, I will put affiliate links in the description below to where you can find it. Um, I hope you guys had a happy 4th of July. Um, and I think that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Keep reading. Don't stop believing. And we will see you again next week. And the videos will resume on Tuesday. Yesterday was a little bit of a...